I'm Lieutenant Chris Gunther, and it's my great honor to serve as a master of ceremonies for today's celebration. This time I ask you please take a moment, silence your cell phones and any electronic devices. Please stand for our opening ceremony and remain standing for our opening prayer. Please welcome Mayor Derek Armstead, Chief David Hart, Officer Michael Richman, escorted by the Linden Police Honor Guard. Please join me in the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I'd like to invite Bishop Manuel Donaldson of Expect a, Miracle, Expect a Miracle Ministries to lead us in prayer. Thank you, Chris. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, thank you for this opportunity. Lord, we thank you for the celebration. We ask that you bless this ceremony today. Bless each and every person that is here. Let us be glad. Let us rejoice. We also pray your blessings over the refreshments, and we thank you for the promotion of Michael today. Amen. Thank you, Bishop. Please be seated. Today we'll be promoting Officer Michael Richmond to the rank of Sergeant. Before we begin our ceremony today, I'd like to recognize the city leaders in attendance, Mayor Derek Armstead, uh, Linden City Council members, Councilman Javik, Councilman Mohammed, and Councilman Roman, City Clerk Joseph Bodek, and uh, thank you for joining us today. Uh, your support is very appreciated. On behalf of Chief Hart and the entire Linden Police Department, I want to thank our elected officials who made t these promotions possible. Mayor Derek Armstead, Council President George Alvarez, First Ward Councilwoman Lisa Worman, Second Ward Councilman Barry Javik, Third Ward Councilman Peter Brown Jr., Fourth Ward Councilman Alfred Muhammad, Fifth Ward Councilman, Rasha Councilwoman Rashana Cosby Hurling. Sixth Ward Councilman, John Roman. Seventh Ward Councilman, Ralph Strano. Eighth Ward Councilwoman, Michelle Yamakaitis. Ninth Ward Councilman, Armando Medina. And Tenth Ward Councilwoman, Gretchen Hickey. Thank you for your continued support. At this time, I'd like to invite Mary Armstead to the podium. Good afternoon, everybody. First of all, I'd like to say it gives me great pleasure to be able to promote a gentleman such as Michael Richmond. You know, over the last 25 years or so, I'd like to think that I've gotten, had the opportunity to at least uh, familiarize myself with people in law enforcement and people who work in the city. And particularly over the last three years, 
I've gotten a chance to um, familiarize myself with a lot of the individuals on the police department. And I think it's a pretty good assessment when I talk about Mike Richmond to say, if there was going to be a contest for one of the nicest guys on the planet, you'd probably be placing somewhere in the top five. Uh, Michael is a gentleman. He's respectful. He's, uh, he's courteous in his conduct. And I think, you know, all those are excellent attributes to have if you're going to be a police officer in a position of leadership. So uh, I just congratulate you, Michael, on your promotion to sergeant. Uh, continue to be the person that you are uh, as you further your career. Uh, continue uh, to provide uh, direction to those underneath you uh, and continue to serve this city the way you've been serving. So God bless you. Uh, God bless your family. Uh, and I see you have a beautiful family here. And, uh, and I'm, I'm, I'm hoping that the apples won't far too, fall too far from the tree. Um, that's usually a good, pretty good assessment. <laughs> okay. Did I, did I speak too soon? <laughs> but anyway, God bless you and continue to, do, to be, to, Continue to be the great officer that you are. Thank you so much. Thank you, Mayor. I'd like to call Officer Richmond to join me in front, please. Michael Richmond graduated from Linden High School in 1999. He holds a bachelor's degree in administration of justice from Rutgers University and earned a criminology certificate in 2003. He was hired by Linden Police Department in January of 2006. And in June of that year, he graduated in the 94th class of the John Stamler Police Academy. Michael was assigned to the patrol division, where he worked as a patrol officer until his assignment to the Traffic Bureau in 2010. Michael quickly became a valuable member of the Bureau. He served as the principal administrator of the red light camera system until the program was discontinued. He also worked as an administrator for the traffic safety grants and was responsible for coordinating a number of enforcement details directed at promoting safer roadways. Michael is a New Jersey Police Training Commission certified emergency vehicle operator course instructor, and he, and he has provided departmental work zone safety and radar training. He also served as president of the Union County Traffic Officers Association and vice president of the New Jersey Police Traffic Officers Association. He has volunteered with a number of charities, including Relay for Life, where, which he has participated in since 2009. Following his promotion, Michael will serve as a field supervisor in the patrol division. Ladies and gentlemen, Michael Richmond. I would like to invite his wife, Catherine, Catherine, to join him up front with their children, Abigail and Michael. Constitution of the United States and the Constitution of the State of New Jersey. And the Constitution of the State of New Jersey. That I will bear true faith and allegiance to the same. That I will bear true faith and allegiance to the same. And to the governments established in the United States. And to the governments established in the United States. And in this state. And in this state. Under the authority of the people. Under the authority of the people. And that I will faithfully. And that I will faithfully. Impartially, impartially and justly, and justly perform all the duties of the office of sergeant. Perform all the duties of the office of sergeant according to the best of my ability. According to the best of my ability. So help me God. So help me God. Congratulations, Sergeant Richmond. At this time, I'd like to invite Chief Hart to say a few words.
Uh, good afternoon. It's an honor to be up here. My, actually, my first official swearing in of a, 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 a promotion of an officer within my department as chief of police. I want to thank our mayor and council again to reiterate what Lieutenant Gunther said. Uh, without our council and our mayor's support, we would not have a strong police department with money, manpower, and equipment. So thank you, Mayor, and thank you to the council. I want to congratulate Michael. Uh, we all know that sergeant is one of the most important positions within the police department, not the chief of police, not the captains or lieutenants. The sergeants at the frontline supervision level really is the most important uh, link in the supervisory and command within the department. Uh, as a sergeant, you're obviously a, you're the supervisor, you're a mentor, you're a trainer, you're, advi you're the advisor to the troops on the ground, whether you're in a squad or in a patrol division. And this is, where, this is where you might see something that's not going right or a violation of something or a policy and or a problem, and they come to you, Mike, as, as this frontline boss. Uh, Mike is a great officer here at the police department, as we all know, and the mayor uh, has uh, spoken about. He's a smart guy. He's personable, extremely loyal. He's very detailed and task-oriented. And he's done a great job in our traffic bureau, Mike. I know your bosses in the, in the uh, traffic division, your other workers in that unit are uh, sorry to see you go, but they're very pleased and you've helped the, our department help the traffic bureau so much. I know you do a great job in patrol. Uh, we will ensure that you succeed. Uh, there will be some supervisory training. And we're here as captains, a chief, and myself, and uh, your other supervisors to help you succeed as a sergeant. You're going to do a great job. I'm real proud of you, Mike. Long time in coming. Well done. Thank you, Chief. I'd like to take a moment to thank those who made today's celebration possible. The Linden Police Honor Guard, the Linden Police Superior Officers Association President, Joseph Birch, Brad Canzo, Jerry Bishop, and the public property staff who prepared the room for today's event. Thank you very much. At the conclusion of our ceremony, we invite all of you to join us for some refreshments, uh, courtesy of the Linden Police Superior Officer Association. Now please stand for our closing prayer. I want to invite everybody to bow your heads and close your eyes, please. Once again, also a congratulation, uh, Sergeant Richmond. Heavenly Father, thank you for the life of this officer and the dedication and commitment he has to protect and serve the citizens of Linden. We pray to you in heaven up above. Watch over him, protect him with your love and with your guidance. Please guide him as he keeps us safe both day and night and protect him as a shield and help him to be a shield to others. Hold him firmly in your care should he ever face uncertainty and protect him from danger. We pray your divine guidance upon him and we pray that no weapon formed against him shall prosper. Dispatch your angels from above to surround him and just like the footprints in the sand poem, carry him and let him know he is not alone. We pray for strength, courage, and the ability to, the ability to be fearless. Give him wisdom, give him dis discernment in every situation. Give him a sense of duty as he serves till duty's end. Finally, we pray your blessings and protection for his family, his children. We thank you for the sacrifices made by the men and women of this police department and all that they do. Amen. Thank you, Bishop. This concludes our ceremony for today. Thank you all for attending.